This video covers friction. Friction is the force that opposes motion when objects slide over each other. For a moving object, friction acts in the opposite direction to the object's direction of motion. And it always occurs at the point of contact. For instance, if this is the direction of motion of the object, then the friction force will be in the opposite direction. And if the object changes its direction, the friction force also changes to the opposite direction. Friction occurs at the point of contact. A greater friction happens on rough surfaces. The rougher the surface, the greater the amount of friction. Now the types of friction. There are four types of friction. The first type is static friction. Static friction is the force that resists the initiation of sliding motion between two surfaces. This type of friction occurs when the surfaces are at rest relative to each other. The static friction increases with the applied force until it reaches a maximum value beyond which motion begins. The second is kinetic friction, also called sliding friction. The kinetic friction is the force that opposes the relative motion between surfaces in contact when they are already sliding. Kinetic friction is generally less than the maximum static friction. The third type is the rolling friction. Rolling friction is the force that resists the rolling motion of a body over a surface. It is usually much smaller than static or kinetic friction, and it depends on factors like the nature of the surface and the radius of the rolling object. The fourth is fluid friction, also called viscous drag. The fluid friction is the force that resists the motion of an object through a fluid that is liquid or gas. This type of friction depends on the object's speed, the viscosity of the fluid, and the shape of the object. The friction force has advantages and disadvantages. The advantages of friction include, it provides the necessary grip for walking, driving, and holding objects. It also enables braking and controlled movement. The disadvantages of friction include, it causes wear and tear on moving parts. It also generates heat, which can lead to energy loss and material degradation. Finally, the applications of friction. The friction force is applied in the braking systems. The braking systems utilize friction to slow down or stop vehicles. It is applicable in walking and driving. Walking and driving depend on friction to provide the necessary grip. It is also applicable in manufacturing. Processes like grinding and polishing rely on friction. To recap, friction is the force that opposes motion when objects slide over each other. There are four types of friction. Static friction, which is the force that resists the initiation of sliding motion between two surfaces. Kinetic friction, which is the force that opposes the relative motion between surfaces in contact when they are already sliding. Rolling friction, which is the force that resists the rolling motion of a body over a surface. Fluid friction is the force that resists the motion of an object through a fluid. The friction force has advantages and disadvantages. The applications of friction include braking systems, walking and driving, and manufacturing.